Hi, this is Nandi from BorderWork.com and today I'll be showing you how to set up your ThreadNet wireless and gaming adapter which you can use with your Wii, Xbox 360, Xbox and PS3. Now this is a um, cheaper and effective way, especially if you have Xbox 360 to connect to your wireless end network. I'm sure a lot of people there have probably gone out and bought some wireless end um, routers. And um, so this is a cheap, effective way. It's actually uh, pretty cost effective. Uh, I believe it retails now for about $24.99 on uh, Amazon. You can find it on other uh, online websites. So let's go ahead, open the box and uh, get started. So we are going to Open this up. And we have our installation CD, our user manual and guide, shows us in various languages. We do have our power adapter, Ethernet cables, and the Treadnet uh, wireless end device, which you plug in your Ethernet cable here, power adapter, and you are good to go. And it pretty much lights up. There is a pretty much power sync button there. Um, so yeah, show you the initial uh, hookup process, which is quite basic with an Xbox 360. So I'm just going to have one of my spare 360s here to show you. This is an older model 360. So if you have an older Elite, uh, not one of the new slim ones, this is very good for you. All you need to do is take your power cord, plug that in, and of course you plug this into the wall. Before that, actually, you know what, I should actually loosen this first. And then you take your ethernet cable, Plug one end right there to your router into your wireless end and plug the other end into your 360. If your router setup is uh, WPS or Wi Fi protected, what you first need to do is press the WPS button on your router, then you press the WPS button on your um, Treadnet. Once the button becomes steady, it will pretty much be blinking, and once it becomes steady, then you connect it um, to your Ethernet port of your Xbox 360 or gaming device. Sorry, pretty much that way. And um, yeah, you're good to go. If not, you have to manually set it up. And to do the manual setup, all you do is you follow the CD instructions. Uh, I'll probably do a video for that. Uh, uh, do follow the CD instructions, and uh, you're good to go. So I went ahead and I pressed the WPS button on my router and I actually held this button down. It blinked and it's now solid blue. After that I connected it to the Xbox, which is below. And um, <sighs> then I just did a connection test, which I'm just going to actually move the camera. So you can see. So it's now, now says configure network. Um, gone done. And I did a connection test and uh, you can see it's connected. So that's pretty much the setup process. It's very easy, uh, painless, and you know, you can get your Xbox connected. Um, and uh, so far, so good, works well. I have no complaints. So um, my, um, let's give you a, a look on how to set up the uh, Treadnet wireless in-game router. Again, it's a cheap alternative option to either buy the Xbox wireless or for your Wii or PS3 if you have an end network um, and it's very easy to set up and use so if you guys have any questions any comments um, don't forget to uh, subscribe to all our pages uh, Twitter Facebook and um, also our YouTube so uh, again this is Dundee from Boardwalk saying thank you and always enjoy entertainment